Hello, my name is Ari Isaac. I'm a GIS analyst at the Port of San Diego, and today I'd like to talk about using the map I insert command to add images into AutoCAD. So let's open up AutoCAD. While it's loading, I'm going to show you sort of the background of how this works. This is a PDF that you should have a hard copy of if you're a, a CAD user. Uh, it's, this is the index for all the images that we received when we purchased our aerial photos. And uh, we are, are interested in this area, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to come down to the insert, which shows the more used area. We want uh, this area, Tuna Harbor, so we're going to get image 267-61839. Um, feel free to contact me if you need another copy of this. Um, I can send you a link. So let's close this out. Let's jump back into AutoCAD. And basically, this process is as easy as just typing in map I, insert, two eyes, and press enter. It should link to the proper folder. If it doesn't link to the proper folder when you when you come to this, then you should contact me so we can set it up. It should only be set up once. And here, our images are TIFF format, so make sure your the, your bottom files of type is TIFF. And then let's track down the image that we want. 627-618-39. And then OK. And this process takes a little time for it to come in, but it should come in in the right place as you can see down here it's processing the image um, and it can take more time if your in your area of interest is on the corner of one of these images where you need to add two or four images in order to make sure you have proper area proper coverage it can also add overhead to the file size when you save the document. So you might want to disconnect the image after you've printed or uh, or something like that. But this is the exact same image as you would use in ArcGIS for AutoCAD, the, the other version. The first thing I would do is select this and whoops, select this and push it to the back so I can see so we can see the CAD drawings on top. But one of the nice things about this is that the image is always at the highest resolution possible. There's no reason to refresh. You're always going to get it uh, at this resolution, and this is a preferred version, a preferred way to, if you're especially if you're printing uh, large plots, which might include numerous images, uh, ArcGIS for AutoCAD uh, isn't optimal for that because the image is a resolution that's highest for the scale that you requested at, and especially if you're printing on a large piece of paper, you're not going to get the kind of resolution. Uh, you're expecting. So I, I suggest you use this image this this way if you're uh, printing. Anyway, uh, if you have any questions, feel free to contact me. My name is Ari Isaac. I'm a GIS analyst at the Port of San Diego. My phone number is 619-400-4778. My email is AISAAK. We're really excited about the Port GIS program, and I hope you are too. Thank you.